Alright guys, welcome back. Alright, so in the last part we did this mission, the restoration, in the divide in Old Russia. And the next mission now is going to be this one, the level 3 story. Investigate reports of a hidden power trapped in the Cosmodrome array stations. Okay, so we're going to fight back any enemies we can find. Let's, um, okay, once again, we can also put this on hard. That makes it level 6 again. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to just jump into it level 3. I think you can do these with a group as well. But I think you might have to go back to the city or invite a friend. I don't know how many people that are playing this at the moment on the beta. So we're just going to solo away. If we come across other players, we'll obviously, you know, won't run away. We'll there get involved. That the fallen back at the Cosmodrome are keeping a pretty tight guard on the old Skywatch. Could be one of their leaders, or it could be something valuable. The speaker's asking guardians to look into it. Okay, the Skywatch is just on the other side of the steps. And it's surrounded by Fallen. Well, I'm ready if you are. Alright, so there's going to be a bunch of enemies around this Skywatch. We're going to have to de defeat them. So these guys are all level 2 now. I think I'm level 3. Take these guys out pretty easily. I'm wondering how many planets they're going to put in the game as well, because there is only one at the moment, which is old Russia, Earth. Where are we going? That way. Let's try the mount. I think we can... You cannot summon. You cannot summon. Okay. In the alpha, you could mount up at this bit, but it's not looking like you can do that right now. You know, this place must have been amazing before the collapse. Thousands of humans boarding the colony ships, off to build cities beyond. Looks like we're heading towards that um, big satellite over there, behind these rocks. That's the array station. Some Russian writing on the wall there. That looks pretty cool, doesn't it? The um, the structures. Right, there's two people over there, level five and six. I wonder now if they're doing Up the, the, hill, the mission with the radar. That's the Skywatch. The Skywatch. All right. Hang on. I think we might have unlocked something in the um, the class upgrade. Yeah, this. I don't understand this. Wait, you've got to press X on this to activate it, but it doesn't say it costs any code, like talent points or anything like that. But you can't use it until you've done that. So now I think I can hover. Yeah. That's what I just did. Just unlocked. Which is, it's pretty cool actually. You can get around and even shoot while hovering around and stuff. Yeah, right, so I think there's going to be some enemies. Just to, Yeah, we go. We can see them on the, um, the indicator on the top left. There we go. Cool, when you finish off with a headshot, the head actually disappears and like sp fades away. This guy's got armor. Oh, he moved out the grenade. Cheeky bugger. Yeah. Once you drop his armor off, though, he falls down pretty easily. So we're going this way, yep. And now we're going this way. And the loot crates are new in the beta as well. Never seen them before. This was one of Skywatch's old array stations, a link to the lunar colony. I think the, these players might be inside here. Respawning restrict. Okay, we're in like a, what's this called? A shadow darkness zone. That's what it's called. The effect around the screen is a bit annoying. I think that fades away though. Yeah, it's gone now. That's kind of cool actually. Dead end. Fallen sealed this gate. I can get it open. It's kind of cool that that's like an indicator. It's a nice little effect. All right, Ghost is going to open this for us. The fallen really didn't want anybody getting in or out. All right, so I'm not too sure we know what's going on here. We just heard reports that they're up to stuff, so we're going in here. To see what they're up to. It's going to be a big fight. Ahead. I've got a bad feeling about this. Oh, like eggs or something, are they? It's disgusting. Oh. It's actually a bit scary, this. The darkness of it. There's one over there. 
control. These are like eight, eight zombie ones, they run at you. Punch him! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Acolyte. Isn't Acolyte like a summoner, normally? Like, they do like ritual stuff, don't they? So maybe you summon in those little ones. Uh, this, this green stuff is shotgun ammo, I believe. The green, see in the bottom left, you can see it next to the shotgun icon. It's like a green little line. I think that indicates that's the color of ammo. Yeah, it is. And white is the assault rifle. Where are we going? This way. That's dark as hell. You can't even go in there. Maybe you gotta clear the area first. Oh, actually, there's another door here. There's a wizard here. You have to kill it. Uh, my ear was it today, sorry. Let's just stop. There's a wizard. Is it Harry? Fuck you! Reloading. Uh. Okay, there's some acolytes. They got down pretty easy, and they're not really shooting much. So there's a, we've already seen like maybe four to five different types of enemies. They're not all the same. We've seen like the um, little grunt ones, the guys with the shields, acolytes, and now the zombie run charging enemies. And we've seen bosses as well. So they got a good selection of enemies to kill. And they all have different abilities and fighting styles. There's also a lot of them. <laughs> Got the wizard there on the left. Here. there he is. Mr. Wizard Man Gotra. Shield down. I think we got him. Oh boy, that was easy. Let's see if we got any loot. I haven't been on Earth in centuries. The darkness could be a lot closer than we think. We should probably get moving. As soon as I killed him, he just all his friends disappeared as well. So if you kill the boss, all the odds just die as well. Just uh, rushed him, and he just dropped. Can we skip the mission? End the mission quicker than thirty seconds. Doesn't look like. I think that's like a timer for like if you're in a group as well. Just lets everyone know. Alright, so we get Fist of Havoc next. <laughs> Maybe get that at the end of the next mission. What the hell's that? That green thing. Let me see what it is. Warping Claws. Oh, it's the mission reward. Hang on. Taken from defeated for all. Retain these to your vanguard sent mentor as proof of the hive's presence in Skywatch. What does that do? Is that activating another quest or something then? It's interesting. All the armor at the moment as well. It's just got defense on it. It's got no um, offensive stats. Like, I don't know, strength. I don't know what I use. I don't even know what the stats are. It's probably going to be random stuff. Alright, so we've done that mission. That was pretty quick. So we can now... What's that mean? Rewards. Yeah, there's rewards to be claimed at the tower. We're gonna keep our flow though at the moment. That's the dungeon. The Devil's Lair. Remember that in the Alpha? Where you do like... I think there's like... Trash and like free bosses. Like big bosses where they take like 10 minutes to kill. Well, they did in the Alpha anyway. Right, so let's do this next mission. This is mission 4. Let's jump straight in. Let's do this. The Vanguard's reporting that Fallen are tearing into machines all over the Cosmodrome. I'm starting to think they aren't just looting the place. Whatever they're looking for, we should probably find it first. I'm picking up heavy Fallen activity near the Forgotten Shore, but that's miles from here. Guardians set up a vehicle grid here. We sink to that. We can summon ground transport from our ship. Let's go. Okay, so now we can access the ground. Oh, we need to get access the grid first and turn it on to allow us to do that. For a multiplayer game, the single like playing it single player is actually pretty fun. You know, you don't feel the need to play with other people. It's still it's just a good shooter on its own. Is it I'm thinking it might have been in the oh actually, is that, is that up there? I was thinking it might have been in the tunnel that we, they, we just walked past. It's telling us to go this way. Now we got over there. Okay. It's a lot of running to do. Looks like whenever you enter a planet as well for a mission, you start in the same place. 
We've started in the same place now, I think, every time. Okay, going over there. There we go, this is it. Here's the sparrow link. What did you call it? Sparrow link. Encoding superpost states, entangling ket vectors, and we're linked. Yeah, that made no sense to me. Ket All vectors. Right. If you want to get your sparrow, we can be in the Forgotten Shore in seconds. In seconds? A lot of seconds. Okay, hold square. Whoop. That's kind of cool. Look at that. His, his legs are stuck inside the grooves. Alright, so can we access the thing? There it is. Okay, we're going this way. Oh! Extra damn dismount. <laughs> I thought I might be able to jump in this. Oh god, what's that? Boost. L2 to boost. So let's get past all these guys. It's Whoa, it actually killed them. <laughs> I like that. That's got some cool, like, Star Wars noises. What's it say? Race through. Race through the Cosmodrome on your Spyro to investigate the heavy fallen activity. This looks quite big, actually, the map. Can you actually see a full map? I don't think you can, can you? Interesting to see, actually, how big the whole zone is. Where are we going? We're oh, going around the corner. This actually plays very smooth. The frame rate's not that bad, you know. People say it runs at like 30 FPS, but approaching the shore. The fallen are using some sort of signal amplifiers. Let's see what they're transmitting. Okay, the play goes to hack into the fallen devices. Okie dokie. There's a player there. Is that a player? Is that a player? I don't even know. Ow. Come on. Can't shoot me and run away. Oh, you run away, fine. Revive. Yeah, there can be revive a player there. I'm not gonna go up there. If this, oh my god. Oh my god! Looks like he's actually respawned, actually. I think that's him. Um, There's a lot of enemies. Let's try and get up here and get some cover up here. Because we're getting shot from across the way as well. Pyah! Alright, let's deploy a ghost on this. Hey! Give me a second. What class is that? I don't even know. Some kind of distorted signal. Not fallen. Let's check the other one. Okay, so we've got nothing from that. We need to go to the next one. That's favor up there. <laughs> Woo! Oh, the boost doesn't last forever. It kind of like it's only like two seconds, and you just drop. Um, okay. I'm thinking that these guys that are actually up here might have cleared the, zone, the whole like section. We won't we'll have to fight many enemies. Actually, never mind. Scrap that. There's loads of enemies. Want to get a better gun now as well? We've leveled up a couple times, and this is the starting gun. And it's better than the one I actually purchased at level two. But I think there'll be a better assault rifle to purchase now, once we get back. Yeah. The enemies are down at an alright speed, but surely they could be quicker. Man, those shields are pain. It just drops though once you destroy the shield. Okay, that's like a green item. It looks like it's encrypted engram. Yeah, that's what they are. You can spend, I think, glimmer to make them into gear. Well, you can just sell it before that if you don't want to gamble. The same transmission. They're both linked to something in Skywatch. Let's check it out. We gotta go back to Skywatch. That's like, all the way over there. Let's get in our vehicle. Woo! I think you can jump in these, can you? Um. Where are we going? Over there. What's the best way? The way we came? Yeah, this way. The boost actually lasts a while. 
the bottom left there is like an icon indicating something's like on cooldown, recharging. But it's not moving. Okay, so once you use the boost, it takes a segment of it. But if you hold it, it doesn't um, doesn't go down anymore. Am I going the right way? Yeah. And it recharges if you're not if you're not using it. Okay, so we're in a sh um, darkness zone. Out. Let's dismount. Have a grenade. That's, that's what are those red things over their heads? Is that like oh that's like a stunned like it, um, indicator when they have like a purple haze over their heads? That's kind of cool. What are these guys? They got swords. Oh, I want to reload so much faster. <laughs> okay, well I'll just want to check inside this little office. This little um, there's nothing in here. <laughs> Waste of time. All right. Oh, a grenade would be so nice in there, but it's on cooldown. We five dead ghosts, what's that? I just don't have like a collectible, I think that was. Ow. Level four! Yeah, what did we unlock? Normally you unlock something. Okay, Fist of Havoc. Smash the ground and dis dissolve nearby enemies in a maelstrom of arc light. It's like an AoE, like. If you know World of Warcraft, like Thunderclap, it looks like. Supercharged, this L1 and R1. Let's use it on the captain then, because he's got armor. I think I have to be close. Whoa! <laughs> That's awesome! I like that. That's like, The animation's cool as well, it goes to third person. And just a big ball of lightning. That's cool. So, like. I feel like Titan is kind of like a melee ranged character, you know, using fast rate, short, close range weapons instead of like being in the distance, obviously, because he's a tank, isn't he? Meant to be getting all the attention. Okay, something's in the back of the room. Okay. That's quite a good AoE blast as well, that's supercharged. Whoa, shit. Whoa! Fuck you! My god, I can't even see. I threw a grenade right there, I don't even know what happened. Oh my god, how did I survive that? I threw a grenade and blinded myself. I think the grenades... Oh yeah, the grenades are flashbang, isn't it? I remember now, but it also does damage. That's what it says in it when I first did. Unlocked it. Okay, we got rid of his shield. It's gonna regenerate though. Most likely. As long as we keep doing little bits of damage to him, the shield shouldn't regenerate. He's dead. Check on this guy. Boom! Let's deploy the ghost in this. Is this big guy dropping any loot? Nope. The fallen are trying to access these machines, but something is fighting back. This will take some time. Okay, so we're gonna defend it now. Hello! Have a grenade. That was a short throw grenade. Actually, wasn't that? It's quite effective, though. I think these two are stunned still. Yeah, they're down. There's, two, there's a few guys on the left now. Supercharged. I save that for either a boss or a massive pack of enemies. And it looks like it might be a massive pack of enemies because there's loads of there. There's a captain there. We don't need it just yet. Because we're still actually able to deal with them. Just the gun. We are running low on bolts though. Like 70 bolts maybe. Um, this captain guy. Grenades almost off cooldown. These little flying things are a pain. What are they called? Shanks. Yeah, I'm, I'm almost out of bullets. Ten bullets left. Out of bullets. Let's see if we can pick up some ammo off these guys. They should have something, surely. 
I want to give these guys a grenade. Oh god, I just walked that myself. That was clever. Oh, supercharge this. Oh yeah! Oh my god! <laughs> Generated seven orbs of light. What does that mean? Does that mean I killed seven enemies? Shit, over there. Uh, oh, did it, are they orbs of light? Oh no god, what's that? That's an enemy. <laughs> what the hell was that? I've got, I've got ammo anyway for this assault rifle now. Shit, what are these? Servitor. What? Got a lot of health. I know that much. Can ghosts be killed? I hope we do. I hope we can't. Whoa, they explode and they die. I think my supercharge ability just um, fills up over time. I don't think it's... Um, I have to kill enemies to fill it up. There's one more drag right there. Anyone else? Okay, I pulled out everything they managed to steal. We should destroy this thing. We're gonna destroy it. This? I'm just shooting it. Shoot the that bit, the blue bit. Sweet! That's the end of the mission. They didn't get much. Kept hitting an active firewall. Old Earth. Russian. Okay. The legends are true. A war mine did survive the collapse. Rasputin. An AI built to defend Earth. He faced the darkness and survived. And he's protecting something here in the Cosmodrome. We have to find a way to reach him. Stormfist is the next ability. Got a new weapon there as well. I think we actually got a weapon last time as well. I forgot to look, didn't I? I think in the beta might be all of the old Russia missions, maybe. You know, and then it'll end when you've got to head to the next planet for the more um, missions. So let's quickly just check. Is there more missions? Yeah, so we're still going. Hang on. That one, yeah. Five. Alright, that's cool. So um, I'm going to head back to the tower. And we'll start the next part once I've upgraded all my stuff, and um, we're in the we we'll start the next part, of the next mission. In between this part and the next part, we'll I just um, purchase any upgrades I can find, and you know sell all stuff I don't need, and equip stuff that I have found. All right, guys. So um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next part. See ya.